think thing. one thing we want to uh, kind of tout is the Biodiversity Summit coming up October 22nd at yeah. MTSU. Statewide, but mm-hmm. it, it just so happens that it does happen in Region 2 here. And uh, it's going to be a lot of... Uh, Really good information shared about uh, from the speakers that that will be presenting, and uh, there might even be a an announcement or two that are pretty exciting for yeah wildlife in Tennessee. Yeah, and right. it's going to be it's for everybody. It's not just for for the non game folks. It's for hunters and anglers and everybody yeah. who enjoys wildlife. It, it'll be a great conference. I know they're they're hoping to to you know reach about three hundred or so people to register, and it's it's going fast. So. Yeah. GoOutdoorsTennessee.com is how you register for that. Uh, or you can go to tnwildlife.org and get all the details about, you know, the events of that day. But they're talking mussels. They're talking crayfish. They're talking, you know, birds. Yeah. And all kinds of fun stuff. Uh, like I said, maybe uh, some, some cool announcements there. And that's a free event, correct? No. No. No, it is not. not. Free. Okay. No, but it has been. Almost. We've had great partners, <laughs> great sponsors. And I'll, actually, while we're talking about it, I'll pull it up. I think it includes lunch too, doesn't it? Yeah, it does. Yeah, it does. I figure we should mention that. But the keynote speaker is is Roger McCoy. Um, so that's that's a cool addition there for keynote. But um, but sponsors we got Bridgestone, uh, TVA, uh, the Greg Vital Center, Nature Conservancy. Uh, so a lot of cool sponsors who have made this happen so that the cost can be you know smaller. I think it's what fifty bucks for uh, yeah for a general admission. You get a light breakfast lunch and a snack and all that and then student registration is 25 so you know those um that's minimal for an event like this thanks to our sponsors for pulling all that together and helping us uh, launch this inaugural event and hopefully one that will continue uh for years to come